we are going to be playing every single FIFA game ever. Starting all the way back at the very beginning with FIFA 97, the first FIFA game released on PlayStation, going all the way through every single FIFA game until we reach FC 25. We're going to load up a game and we're going to score a goal with every single cover star from every single game. This might just be the biggest video we have ever done, so please be sure to like, be sure to subscribe. We're going for 1 million subscribers, so come be part of it with us. And so, let us begin with FIFA 97. So, starting things off in FIFA 97, the very first cover star was Newcastle's very own David Ginola. I get to start this off with a goal from one of my team's players. Decided to give myself an easy go of it to start things off with Queen's Park Rangers. Let's go with Newcastle versus Chelsea to start off. God damn, Chelsea are arse in this. I guess this is Chelsea pre the money coming in. So out come the players and let's bag goal number one. There isn't even a sprint button. There isn't even a sprint button. Oh, a bit of separation here. Maybe a chance. Oh, come on, keepers. Read it. Oh. F me, the controls on this thing are ridiculous. Cross into the middle. And a goal, but it's all. Oh, it's by Les Ferdinand. Nice header, but it's not with Ginola, so it's not going to count. We need to score with the cover star. Oh, oh, what a ball. What a ball. Oh, He's cool. so in here. Ginola. Oh, f score. There's the half time whistle. Oh, my God, it's half time. This, ga this f***ing game is unplayable. I get it was only 1997, but it feels illegal to have released a game this shit. Go on, what a run. What a run. Oh my god, this keeper saves every shot that I take with Ginola. Oh my lord. Where are you passing that ball, bro? Someone want to make a tackle? No! What the f is this game? Oh my god, I actually lost. I actually lost, and I still haven't scored with him. Here we Go again, please. This might take me forever. Go on. Go on. Shoot. Finally, yes! It took 15 seconds only in the next game. Oh, in this monstrosity of a game, any goal is a banger. I'm ticking it off. On we go to FIFA 98. I hope to God the controls are a little bit better, at least in 98. Took me almost an hour to score last time. In FIFA 98, the cover star was the one and only David Beckham, a very young David Beckham. Let's tee up a game in England at what I believe is the old Wembley. Oh, hell yeah. They had the, they had 3D intros to stadiums way back in the day. And now they come. It's England v Mexico, a, a fixture that happens all the time. And we're kicked off and underway. And whoa, 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 whoa. What's up with the pace of this game? Jesus Christ. We, there was no pace in 97. We're zipping around the park. Jesus Christ. I don't know how to slow this down or if I even want to. Fucking hell. This is ridiculous. I can barely see what's happening. Oh, could be. Oh, it is! Beckham with the goal and the backflips. Look at this. Pass cutting the defense and then a first time strike sort of. I don't know. From Beckham into the top bins. Lads, these games are monstrosities to play. Okay, I'm doing my best. You know, just a lovely ball cutting the defense and then Beckham with just... Yeah, look, a, fit, <laughs> a lovely finish into the top corner. On to the last game of the 90s, 99. <laughs> We are slowly getting closer and closer to these games actually being playable. The cover star of FIFA 19 was Dennis Bergkamp. And I'm just going to come out and say it. I don't know why it feels like the graphics got worse. Maybe I'm being harsh, but we're kicked off and it's even faster. What is happening? Um, Jesus Christ. Look, we're just trying to, we're just trying to survive. The game speed is on normal. Are you telling me I can make it even faster? Oh, uh, for shits and giggles, why not? Oh, this is about to be something, isn't it? Look at this. Oh my God. This is just ridiculous. Oh, lads, I thought FIFA 97 was hard scoring. This is going to be literally impossible. I can honestly say I've tried so many times. It's a goal. It's from Bergkamp. How did that go in? I don't know. Slow motion replay. It somehow got to him. It was all a blur. I don't care. We've somehow scored with... Oh, my God. I don't care if I'm getting smashed 4-1. Do you see what is happening? I thought it was going to take me hours to score, and it just fell for... Oh, thank the Lord. Oh, my. Into the new millennium. FIFA 2000. 
Now this is going to be quite difficult because the FIFA 2000 cover is Sol Campbell, a defender. I may try to sneak him up top and see how he goes as a striker if it takes too long. Maybe I can get him a goal from a corner, that'd be sick. But yeah, it's going to be him starting at centre back for now. And off we go, last PlayStation game and good, we're playing at a normal tempo. Nice ball there. Oh, is that going to be? Oh, I think it is. So Campbell. That's a lovely finish. Lovely pass there. They're not picking him up. And a lovely finish into the top left-hand corner. Yeah, we moved him up a bit. Look at that. Goalkeeper saw out of position. And just a oh, tremendous strike from a center back. Now that we're done with the PlayStation Fevers, hopefully I won't have an aneurysm trying to score a goal. Let's move over to FIFA 2001. <laughs> Fun fact for any of you that care, FIFA 2001 was like the first FIFA game I ever played. So I'd like to think hopefully I've got some sort of uh, muscle memory here when it comes to this game. The cover star of 2001 was Paul Scholes. EA sure loved their English cover stars. Let's go with that classic England v Argentina. And I think that might actually be him on screen right there. Jeez, the graphics got a mega update. Thank the Lord. Hell yeah, baby. Let's take it to him. Ah, uh, yes. This is a much, much better. Oh, come on. Get the cross in. Bring it down. Have a strike. Oh, it's a good save. Oh, that is a horrid tackle. Oh, and it is a red for Emil Heskey. This is going to make things a bit more difficult. Oh, we got a bit of space here. I can try from downtown. Why the hell not? Oh, it's a bit too much. Still haven't scored a goal yet as we start the second. Beckham, cross. Who's in the middle? Oh, what a save. Headed to the goal. I think it's in. Is it a goal? It is from Skulls. I thought he'd be off. For sure. No idea how he's being kept on side there, but we will take it. First and through there. He's definitely away again here. Surely it's a top end finish. Another one for Skulls. Too much pace. They tried to hack him twice, actually, and it didn't work. Get in there. I actually start to feel like I've got some control now. Next up, FIFA 2000. <laughs> Hopefully, I've got a pretty easy task this time around because the cover star of FIFA 2002 was Thierry Henry, and he knew how to put them in the back of the net. Hopefully, then, that is him, by the way. <laughs> that's, a, that's a, uh, I don't know, a questionable model, but for 2002, whatever. And off we kick off for this one. Oh, lovely block. Love that from Cole before he turned into Cashley. Oh my god, alright, well we're 1-0 down early. Marie's still going with this. Oh, not a bad effort. I'll go for it. Oh my god, that nearly went up in. Maybe a 1-2 here. Oh, ball up over the top's not quite what I'm after. Oh my god, is every f***ing shot gonna go wide? I can't deal. I thought this was meant to be like Invincible's arsenal. The ball finding its way somehow. is that a Foul. I thought it was a good block. That's a great block. Ref! Oh my god, and we, we lose the first game. I just f***ing re missed every shot. Let's try this again, Thierry, and this time try to get it on the other side of the post. Oh, that's a brilliant. Oh, please, just do it to him again. Oh, he's gone around too many of them. And finally! Alrighty then. Again, I'm uh, sketchy on the model, but it's a lovely ball one back. Going around the defender. Where is he going? And slotting it in the bottom corner. Finally, we get it at last. On to 2003. Now, this will be interesting because FIFA 2003, we actually get to take our pick. It was the first cover with three stars, and those stars were Ryan Giggs, Edgar Davids, and Roberto Carlos. We've had a lot of Manchester United and Arsenal players, so I'm going to go with Roberto Carlos, and let's see if we can score an absolute screamer with him from distance. I'm literally just going to be spamming bombs from distance. If we somehow manage to get a free kick with him too, I'll take that as well. And we are kicked off and underway now with this one. Distance. Long. Oh my god, are you telling me that nearly went in? Holy crap, that had some height and that keeper, if it was just a little bit to the left. Oh, I'm telling you, he's got this goal in him. He definitely does. Oh, he's gone past him. Oh, that is disgusting, but it sets up a free kick. Look at this. Naughty, naughty on Roberto. So you're telling me if I, I have no idea how the free kick system in this game works, but oh, it's a little out of the green, but we'll have a pop at it anyway. Yeah, didn't think so. God, they're hacking him to death right now. Ah, see, now we were just too far away last time. That's all right. Oh, I've absolutely nailed that. 
Don't tell me it could end up in. Oh, get in there. That had more swerve on it than he, than he managed in real life, bro. That was ridiculous. Last chance, last chance. And I got to shoot because I am out of time. Oh my god, man. Oh, I have scored bangers from this distance before. That just won't go in for him. Well, I'll tell you what. Roberto Carlos can score this penalty to win the game. Will he do it? You better believe it he does. And that's... That's going to have to be our goal. We can't score them from 30 yards out. We have to score it from the six-yard box. We had to score it from the penalty spot. Oh, if only this one had just crept in. Oh, man, that's going to haunt me. Off we go then to FIFA 2003. Oh, FIFA 2004 also had three cover stars. Again, Henri was on there. Ronaldinho was on there, but I get the feeling he's going to pop up quite a fair bit, so we won't do him. Instead, we'll go with Alessandro Del Piero. So let's load up a game with Juventus and see if we can bag him a decent one. So it's going to be Juve and Inter Milan, and the games are genuinely only starting to look better and better now, aren't they? Oh, is that the... Oh, no way. I didn't know they had Pierre Luigi Colina in this one, but off we go then. All right, next game underway. Oh, 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 how in the world? How have I squeezed in a goal from there? What is the goalkeeper doing? He's falling asleep. <laughs> I'm right in his face and the keeper just watches as I head it in. That is pure and utter match fixing right there. You can't explain it any other way. Well, that was mighty quick. All right. Meanwhile. Fucking, 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 fuck me. This game is pissing me off. Get fucking away, you fucking. <laughs> All right, on to FIFA. What? 05. <laughs> Now, in FIFA 2005, again, there were three cover stars. One was another Arsenal player in Patrick Vieira. Fernando Morientes and the man I think I'm going to score with in this one, it's Andrei Shevchenko. Look at AC Milan at this point. 90 rated attack midfield and defense. Maldini, Stam, Nesta and Cafu, the back line. Sadov, Pirlo, Gattuso, Kaka, unbelievable Crespo. And then finally, we arrive at Shevchenko. It was just complete anarchy, this AC Milan side back then in the mid 2000s just an absolutely insane team they had back then but apparently not good enough for Liverpool so then kick off in the San Siro let's go and grab Shevchenko who's goal lying in wait Andre Shevchenko we'll get him at some time oh hello Shevchenko oh that's way wide oh fucking hell of course they'd score first and of course Adriano he's got power even in, even in FIFA oh my god why can't Shevchenko do that Shevchenko! Oh my god! That has hit the top of the crossbar! Oh, that is pain. I have sc I've been like this far away from scoring so many bangers. Rebound. Rebound! On the rebound, finally Shevchenko! Had a go, it was saved right at him, but finally, he just beats the defender to the toe poke in time. Shevchenko and 2005 ticked off, and next up in the series is FIFA 06. Now, the two cover stars for FIFA 06 will go on to be the cover stars for quite a while. I am, of course, talking about Wayne Rooney and Ronaldinho. I'm going to go with Rooney for this first one. We're going to set up a little Manchester derby, you know, before before the money rolled in for, for City. Look at that overall, man. Wayne Rooney was a 93 overall, freshly going to Manchester United as a teenager. People do not talk him up enough. Rooney was crazy back in the day. So babyface Rooney gets the game going and I tell you what, he still has hair. So that's how you know he's babyface. Oh, brilliantly one back. Hello. Rooney's got some space. Oh my God. How many fucking bangers have been denied today? Rooney onside here. How about from a super tight angle? Oh, Traveller nearly ending up in. God, I'm just not getting any fucking love from the FIFA gods. We're going to need extra time again because I just keep hitting the damn post. Oh, lovely ball in there for Rooney. Oh, a diving header. That is lovely. Not the goal I thought I would get with Rooney, but a brilliant diving header. And that is a fantastic goal. That's one of the better goals we've scored today. Could have had a lot better ones, but hey, I'll take that. That's not a bad finish at all. Lovely goal. Now from 06 to one of my personal favorite FIFA titles, it's FIFA 07. 
FIFA 07, the last game on the PS2. And let me tell you, man, this was the game I sunk so much time into as a kid. It's what got me hooked on the FIFA games. It's probably one of the reasons why I love Ronaldinho so much as well. Damn, dude, this menu for me is special. The cover stars for this one, again, were Wayne Rooney and Ronaldinho. It was Rooney last time. Let's do Ronaldinho this time. Camp New, looking crisp, looking clean. I love it. We got an El Clasico. Look, they even had the stats of who'd won more games, bro. I mean, oh, it's unreal. Here comes the man that we're trying to get the goal with. Oh, come on. Lovely. Yes! Banger with Ronaldinho. Nice and early. Little step over and just smashes it in. This guy in this game is a little too good. Defender sagging off. Oh, yes. You just look for the ponytail and he will do the rest. It's a ridiculous player. Now, I think we've just won a free kick on the edge of the box. Oh, please. Man, I have completely forgotten how to take free kicks. That's going to surely be way too powerful. On the rebound. Oh, it is in! Ah, ha, ha. What a goal on the rebound! The free kick was no good. It got blocked by the man on the line. But, oh, the, the follow-up. Blocked by Beckham right back to Ronaldinho. And then first time... Damn, bro. I swear, Ronaldinho on this game was just special. And that is why. The ball and net physics kind of fucked me up there a bit. But, oh, what a goal. Banger from Ronaldinho. Now over to PS3 and FIFA 08. Once again in FIFA 08, the cover stars were Wayne Rooney and Ronaldinho. So let's go back to Rooney. Damn, poor guy fell off. He's, oh, he's dropped all the way down to an 87. Oh, the nostalgia is hitting me so hard right now. This is hilarious. The aesthetic of this game really changed a lot from like PS2 to PS3. Cristiano, ball, Rooney, no good. Oh, we got a great chance on here. You fucking stupid game. That's not who I wanted. You fucking stupid fucking game. I'm fucking obviously not pointing there. Oh, come on. Oh my god, every fucking shot is over the bar. I am tapping the shoot button and it's generating like max power. I'm going to just tap the shoot button and it gets to like max power. Oh, oh big gap now. Come on, yes! Finally, the gap opens up. We run right into it and into the top bins. I swear I tap this and even that is just at full pace. On now to 09. Once again, Ronaldinho was the cover star, except this time he moved to AC Milan. So we're at the San Siro. Let's see if we can bag another banger with Ronaldinho. Kicked off and underway. I got the goalkeeper, Abiati, all the way up here. He might try to get an assist. Oh, there he is. Ronaldinho is in. Oh, I love that. Ronaldinho. Little Elastico. Oh, for the woodwork. We finish off his dinner, but damn it. I am sick to death of the woodwork in this damn video denying us so many great goals. We need to remove the post from football goals now. I don't care. Like, literally, I don't know how that even fucking works, but I'm just so pissed off it needs to happen. Up over the top. Oh, somehow it's gotten through. Hello. Ronaldinho is in here. Ronaldinho's. Got the keeper to come all the way out. That has to be. And it is a penalty. Ha <laughs> ha. All right. Do I know how to take penalties? Ronaldinho. He scores. Pass Buffon. Wins the pen and converts. All righty then. We'll take it. That's a bit of a, that's a, bit of a jokes one. Moving on quick. FIFA 10. Once again, Rooney was on the cover. But finally, we have new cover stars. Theo Walcott and the man I'm going to be using for this one, Frank Lampard. At long last, we finally get to switch it up a little bit here with Lampard. Brought down. Strike. Hits the post. What happened to the goalkeeper? The keeper disappeared. Of course, we hit the woodwork again. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, no. FIFA 10 is ha not having a good time of it. Look, again, the goalkeeper, he's nowhere to be seen. Oh, my God. There's the goalkeeper. He's stuck in the... <laughs> what is happening? Uh, mate, do we, need a, do we need to get somebody? Let's get the ball here to Lampard. Get an open space. And what a banger! Oh, that's an unbelievable finish. Oh, dearie, dear. I have no idea. The poor goalkeeper. Look, it's just absolutely unstoppable, that. It's an absolute thunderstrike. Is the keeper back? The keeper is back. Oh, no, he's gone. Yeah, holy crap. FIFA, yeah, FIFA 10 has had it now. Everyone has disappeared except for TDA Trogba. Word of advice, boys. If you can find a girl that can do this. Oh, my God. Never let her go. That's <laughs> a, oh, a FIFA 11. FIFA 11 again, Rooney on the cover, but Kakar as well after he moved to Real Madrid. I'm telling you, man, FIFA took a step up with 11. This game was elite. Good one. Kaka, why do I have a go on the first volley? Oh, it's over. Oh, oh it's going to get to him there. Diving header. Oh, 
that's a bit of a weak one. We can do better. Oh, what a ball chop there from Ronaldo. But he's not the man we're looking for. It's fucking caca. I can't get it to him. I got a free kick here. This might be possible. I remember being somewhat decent at free kicks. Oh, it's over. Ball's up over the top. Kaká on the volley. Oh my god! It's a fucking joke at this point! It's every fucking game. Just slot it, mate. Oh my god. Rebound. You know what? Fuck this. Bro, this game. Oh. Bro, I can't even be asked anymore. <laughs> I genuinely can't be asked anymore. It's FIFA 12. In FIFA 12, again, Rooney on the cover, but Jack Wilshere. Uh, that's quite an intriguing one. When we were all so sure he was going to turn into, like, this huge thing and it just didn't it didn't pan out. Going up against Spurs with bloody, what, Modric, Bale, Rafael van der Vaart. Oh, I got a selfie with van der Vaart recently. Yeah, there you go. Just a minor flex there for you. This is crazy. Like, FIFA 12 is the first ever FIFA game I started making videos on. And now, here we are about to enter FC 24. Fucking Christ, I am old. Down for Wilshere. Oh, that's a banger. What a goal from Jack Wilshere. Cleared away, comes out to Jack. And of course we hit the woodwork again, but this time in off of the post. Or crossbar, you know what I mean? That is a certified banger. And we keep the streak of hitting the freaking woodwork going. Now to FIFA 13. I'm on top of the world. FIFA 13 began the long reign of Lionel Messi as the cover star. So, of course, let's get one with Messi. This is also the last game before we switch over to PS4. We're playing this game in the Aesthetico Azteca, which is a stadium you can't even play in anymore in FIFA. Can we recreate Maradona's goal of the century here maybe with Messi? That would be sick. Kicked off. Underway. Oh, what's a ball. And, oh, dragged wide. Lovely ball that, Messi. What a ball. Oh, lovely f***ing pass that is. Messi, lovely ball, Messi. Oh, he nearly went around him. Oh, cutting ball, we love that. We love that. Messi, the dink, fucking hell. Oh, lovely one back ball. And now it's Messi with a lovely dink. Oh, he sure loves a cheeky chip. Early 2010s, Messi was chipping blokes like crazy. The last of the PS3 games, and now we move to FIFA 14. Yeah. Once again in FIFA 14, the cover star was Lionel Messi, so let's run it back. This would also have to be one of the last games that actually had the Camp Nou in it. And God, even for FIFA 14, it was looking sweet. There he is then. All right, let's get him his goal. Oh, come on. He's in the tightest of areas. I think he's off here. Oh, I think he's off. He's got to be, yeah. Of course he will be. Oh, just snuck it off of him like a librarian. You love that. Messi. On his right foot. I don't know if he can... Oh, my... It wouldn't be. It wouldn't be an attempt on goal if I didn't hit the post. I have to hit the post every f***ing FIFA. Left peg, maybe. Messi. Oh, my God! On my life, I've not tinkered with sliders or nothing. That is a screamer. I saw a bit of a gap. Thought I'd go for it. Oh, my God. That is, a, that is ridiculous. It's so fast, the camera can't even keep up with it. Oh my god, Messi. That is absolutely mental. Casillas, like, what the fuck am I supposed to do about that? Messi with a foot like a traction engine. All right, well, that is a belter. Wow, okay then. FIFA 15. Once again, we had Messi on the cover of FIFA 15, but a new face joined him in, of course, Eden Hazard. I swear this was peak Eden Hazard too. Chelsea won the Premier League this season and oh, he was insane. Let's go get that goal then at the Stamford Bridge. Man, I won't even lie. I kind of miss these old Premier League graphics a bit. The Premier League now is great, don't get me wrong, but it doesn't hit like old Barclays. Oh, misses that slide tackle. Blocked. Back for him. Oh, he's won that back sublimely. Oh, burst of pace. He's a ridiculous dribbler. Absolutely elite there in Hazard. That's what we're talking about. He had some ridiculous control. Oh, man. Bring back this end in Hazard. What happened to him? He was special on his day, bro. Now in FIFA 16, we do have uh, a bit of an odd selection for the cover star. Yes, it was Messi again, but we also had a couple of other cover stars. One included Jordan Henderson. So, Jordan Henderson it is. We are going to get a goal with the Liverpool captain. That is the plan at least. Here at Anfield, prior to the, rel uh, you know, to the renovations, easy to forget sometimes, you know, this stadium normally did not have that big a capacity. We are on the home stretch, folks. Let's go get this goal at Anfield. Oh, Coutinho's won this back here. Hello, we got Hendo. Oh, that's going to be a free kick. Yes, it will be. He's got some. Uh, he's got some average free kick taking stats. He might be able to get this. Come on now, up over the wall and oh my god, I thought it was in. I could have swore that was going in. How has this gone wide of the post? Unbelievable. 
got a chance on here. Go on, Henderson. Yes! Finally, we get it. Jordan Henderson in front of the cop, the Liverpool captain. We get the goal. He just is able to bang this in past Hugo Lloris. The free kick would have been nicer, I admit. But either way, we get the goal. Come on. Anyway. For 17 people, of course, the legendary Marco Royce was the cover star. And let's head over to the Bundesliga at Signal Iduna Park. I don't know if you're really uh, classified as a football fan if you aren't a little bit of a fan of Marco Royce, man. Easily one of the better FIFAs in my personal opinion. Five minutes later. I can't believe I said this was a good game. This is f***ing shit. Oh, where are the defenders going, man? Oh my god. Oh my God! Can't get the ball back no matter how many times I try. God knows what it is. We're going to have to go to extra time to get this goal. I swear to God, man. That is if we, I'm starting to think get it at all. I don't know why. I just can't score in this game. R look at the stamina of Marco Royce. How are the long shots in FIFA 17? Oh, maybe not that good. Maybe not to beat Neuer. Oh. Oh, it's a goal. I don't even think it's... Oh, my God. It's not even by bloody Royce. It's by Mark Bartra. The game literally didn't... E I didn't even score that. that. Like, the game... I wasn't even controlling Bartra at all there. Can't believe it. This bloody game, it stole the header from Royce. Come on. Aubameyang. Aubameyang sort of away. Don't know how I get this ball to Royce. Maybe like this. Maybe like this. Come on. Finally, at long last, Marco Royce hits the back of the net. Man, we had to work. We had to work hard for that. God knows how long that took. FIFA 18, for the very first time, was graced by Cristiano Ronaldo. Of course, he was the cover star. So we're going to be scoring a goal with Cristiano Ronaldo. Hopefully, that won't be too difficult. Surely not anywhere near as hard as it was with Royce. Here at the Santiago Bernabeu in El Clasico. Let's do it then, lads. Finally, it's time to get one of the two respected goats, whoever it is you go for. Time to hit the back of the net with CR7. Come on. We're going to start things off by bodying Leo Messi off the ball. Going to send a ball up over the top. I don't think Ronaldo is going to get to this one. Oh, how about this, though? Uh, don't know about it. Oh, don't know about it. Don't know about it. Oh, what a goal. Had to sort the feet out a little bit, but soon. Right up into the top bins. We take the touch to go around the defender. And Ronaldo sticks it in the absolute upper echelon right-hand corner. Ridiculous. Yeah, that didn't take anywhere near as long as scoring with Marco Royce, did it? Now, in FIFA 19... Technically, the cover star was Cristiano Ronaldo again, but uh, EA may or may not have panicked when a certain RAPE uh, allegation sort of came out around that time. So they ended up going with Neymar, Kevin De Bruyne, and Dybala, and you know what? We're gonna go with Neymar. Fresh from his move from Barcelona to PSG as well. Let's try to get the most expensive signing in world football, his goal here in FIFA 19. God, I mean, it was sort of cool at the start to see him at PSG, but at the same time, God, I kind of just wish he'd stayed at Barca, you know what I mean? Oh, well, what's in the past is in the past. Let's get it done. Come on. Go on, Mbappe. Get this thing kicked off. We're rolling. Oh, that is some beautiful. Drops his defender. This is ridiculous skill. Go on, finish it, Neymar! <laughs> he absolutely bodied like two defenders there. Only for him to hit. Oh, the bloody woodwork. We're on the move here with Neymar. Little Ronaldo chop, get out of the way, Mbappe! Oh, it's just wide again. Oh, get stuffed. That's ridiculous. He's holding me off, referee. Mate, Neymar, if he does that, he'll put that in the face. Because Neymar, you can hit hard like that, but you can hit way harder like that. I mean, fucking boom! Here we go, man. Oh, he's carved his way through there! And in the 90th minute, we get the goal! Neymar with the ceiling goal right at the death. He sliced up and diced up the defense on multiple occasions, but he waits until the very last second to slot it into the bottom corner. Gets in there, Neymar, finally. <laughs> 
Now in FIFA 20, after his very big move at the time to Real Madrid, it was Edin Hazard that got to don the cover of FIFA 20. I think if Real Madrid knew how that transfer would go, they might not have gone for it. But nonetheless, our task is set. We're going to get the 91 rated Edin Hazard, hopefully a goal. Can you believe that only a couple of years later, he would flat out retire from football? But yeah, kicked off. Benzema gets it underway. Nice little move there from Hazard. Hasn't completely... Oh my God, escaped Kieran Trippier yet. Oh, fuck you, Casemiro. Come on, man. Hazard. Oh, slide and miss. And once again, a super tight angle. And again, it's a wait. It's a penalty. Oh, Hazard wins the pen and he's going to get Savage sent off. Hey, why not get him to score it from the spot? We're going to stick this right up into that top right-hand corner. Go on, Hazard. Go on, Hazard. Yeah! He did not score all too many for Real Madrid in the Bernabeu, but there you go. I'll accept the penalty, especially considering he's the one that won it. Now, FIFA 21, of course, we had the cover star be killing Mbappe for the first time. He got himself all the way up to a 90 overall in FIFA 21. And that overall of his just has not looked back. Let's see what kind of goal we can get here with killing Mbappe. Probably won't be a free kick. He is in there. Not known for his headers. Although, cool. Come on. I see a gap there for him. Left foot of Neymar. Oh, left foot of Mbappe! There we go. Nice and early. Getting that one ticked off. Let's go. Sent through with Neymar's right foot, not his left. And then it's Mbappe who finishes it off. Right on then, people. Let's go. Over to FIFA 22. Now, people, the cover star, once again, actually, for FIFA 22, was again Kylian Mbappe. So let's load up another game with Kylian Mbappe. This time, we'll switch up the club football for the international football. With a replay here of the 2022 FIFA World Cup. Mbappe did all he could in that final, especially toward the end. Unfortunately for him, it was not quite enough. But let's see if we can get him this goal. Come on. One, two. Up over the top. Similar goal to the... Oh, no. Look at this. Mbappe. Oh, he's brought it down. Headed down for him. Mbappe. Oh, flick. Goal. Oh! Oh, yeah. That is a banger. What a finish. Look at this. Just headed down for Mbappe. He flicks it up for himself and volleys it with the right foot past bloody Emmy Martinez. That is one of the better goals I think we have scored so far today. Woo, baby. That's got to take some topping and we've only got a few more left to go. Now, FIFA 23, for the third year in a row, Mbappe was the cover star, but he was also joined by fellow Australian in Sam Kerr. That's right, ladies and gentlemen, can you believe it? We're about to score with a female. Here in the UEFA Women's Champions League, we are gonna take on Leon. Let's do this then, Sam Kerr. Let's get you this fellow Aussie a goal. Oh, hello. Down. Oh, nearly Kerr. I can't lie. I don't know what it is about playing with the ladies, but they all feel just so rapid. Sam Kerr is in and Sam Kerr scores. Oh, come on. As if they don't have her goddamn backflip anime or front flip animation. Oh, well, it wasn't quite there yet, but oh my God. I can't believe it. Every player on this Chelsea women's team just moves like they're rapid. It's ridiculous, man. So in FC24, after a good couple of years of killing Mbappe being the cover star, they decided to switch things up with the name change and go with Erling Haaland. Off the back of his just utterly ridiculous first season for Man City. Hey lads, who do you think's better? Prime Haaland or Prime Anthony? Let's get it kicked off with Haaland in the penultimate game before the big one, FC25. Oh, what a move. Come on. Okay, what's his crossing like? Oh, come on. What a... Oh! Ha -ha! What a beautiful little bit of skill from Erling Haaland before the thunderous finish. What's that? A cheeky little heel-to-heel -heel drag flip to drop bloody Martinez and rocketed into that top right-hand corner. Go on. He's too big. He's too powerful. There's only one left to go. And here we are, people. Finally at last in FC 25. We have reached the end of the road, and of course, as we all know, 
Jude Bellingham is the cover star of FC 25. So we're going to load up a game with none other than Real Madrid. And let's face Dortmund, the previous Champions League final. And let's complete the journey here at the Santiago Bernabeu. And there he is, ladies and gentlemen. Most likely the Ballon d'Or winner coming up. Right on. Let's do it then, people. Last goal of the video. We are kicked off and underway. Love that tackle. It should be clean. It better be. Oh, that is a brilliantly one back ball. We've got Mbappe. Mbappe's going to have to knock it forward. There he is. Jude Bellingham. It's in. There is your goal. And there he is. Belly goal. Bellingham. There you have it, ladies and gentlemen. The new boy links up with the probable Ballon d'Or winner. Jude Bellingham wraps it up. That is every FIFA ever. I hope you've enjoyed. Thank you all for watching. I really hope you liked it. It took a lot of effort, a lot of time to put this together. So be sure to like, be sure to subscribe. And if you have enjoyed this one, then be sure to click on this video as well for plenty more.